Hello and welcome to the DeSigo Optic, Engineering Fundamentals, Other Network Topologies. For other network topologies, the network settings may vary. We would like to show a few more examples with configuration here. In this topology, which comes from a customer project in the field, a 4G dongle has been used for the internet connection to the cloud. By the way, 4G modems are also supported. The IP address for the LAN connection of the F200 device is defined here. This is the WAN IP address of the 4G dongle. The firewall settings refer to the default BagNet UDP port and the two already known TCP ports that must be opened to communicate with the DeSigo Optic web client. For the tunnel feature, only the secure connection has been configured. In this document we can find the instructions on how to set up the 4G devices. This document can be downloaded from this learning. The settings in the gateway are as follows, this is the result of the IP settings. In the case of the firewall, we have the well-known three ports that have to be released. For the tunnel we have the two known settings for the DeSigo Optic web server with secure connection port and the default setting. The customer wishes additionally to have a direct connection to the gateway with his PC. We now have an additional router in the LAN network. Dot in this particular case, we need to use the routing of the gateway so that the client PC can reach the F200 device directly. This is what the customer wants. In the menu item route, both gateways must also be entered for this solution, considering the correct network type, which in our case is LAN. We have a single network here, which is used by the building automation devices and for the connection to the cloud. The IP address for the LAN connection of the F200 device is defined here. In this network mode, there is another special feature. The default gateway must also be entered in the LAN settings. The WAN port is not used and therefore does not need any configuration. The firewall settings are in the meantime familiar to us. There is no configuration of routing and proxy needed for this solution. For the tunnel, it is necessary to configure the secure communication port. We would like to point out once again that in this network mode all devices of the building automation are on the internet and therefore additional configurations against cyber attacks are required on the router of the internet provider. We have a new configuration situation for the IP settings. The standard gateway must also be entered in the LAN settings, as shown here. And no configuration is required for the WAN interface. The other settings are already familiar to us. We move on to the next topic, how to register the F200 device without a direct internet connection.